88% of Congress stands for election every two years. 88%. The president stands for election every four years. Space missions require planning, budget cycling, planning, R&D, development, and execution that last way longer than these political cycles, these political wins. And so we need a way to assure a continuity of mission statement for NASA, regardless of what happens in the White House or outside of the White House. And that's a challenge. It means now a president might want to promise something in the future, 20 years from now, but is that president still president 20 years from now? No. Is there a budget line corresponding to that now? No. So what does it mean to promise it? These are the challenges of NASA, and it's been that like forever. So I think in the end, the mission of NASA rests with the electorate. Because if we all want to go into space for reasons that you would, I think, have to justify for yourself. I can help you do that, but I'm not going to twist your arm. I'm, not, I'm just going to alert you of the, cause, of the consequences of inaction, the consequences of action, and what that can do for us. But then you decide. It's a free country. You decide. It won't matter what one president thinks relative to the, the next one. We'll be electing people into power who all share this vision. So it's not, gee, I wonder what this president thinks about the vision. I will know what that president will think about the vision because we voted for that person to enter office on a platform that embraced space exploration from the beginning.